Shalom. Good morning. This is Morning Devotion with Katie. We shall continue where we stopped yesterday. We're still talking about lifting. Turn with me as we read once again Psalm 27, verse 6. I read from the King James Version of the Bible. And now shall my head be lifted up above my enemies round about me. Therefore I will offer in this tabernacle sacrifices of joy. I will sing, yea, I will sing praises unto the Lord. God is telling us five things today. First of all, he says it will be in his tent, in his tabernacle, that will offer sacrifices. A tent is his dwelling place. If you're in his dwelling place, that means you're in his presence. And number two, if you're in his presence, it means that you are in a place where there's fullness of joy. Number three, according to Psalm 27 verse 5, God has a secret place of his pavilion where he can hide you and I. Number four, as a result of the fact that he's hiding you there, you will offer sacrifices to him. And a sacrifice is not something that you give because it's convenient, because I know a lot of things are not convenient for us now. But as you give that sacrifice, it will break into joy in the name of Jesus. And once you break into joy, you, you can be sure that your joy is going to be such that the world will be attracted to it. So if you are joyful right now, just come on, make some noise for Jesus. Just shout, hallelujah, and exercise your lungs, even if you can't exercise your legs. By the way, we should try to make sure we exercise our legs, even if we're staying at home. Just make sure you observe social distances. Number five and the last, because of the joy that you have, you are going to sing praises unto the Lord. I prophesy that somebody here is going to have a party or a celebration and a special thanksgiving. Why am I so sure? You see, apart from your personal testimonies which are certain to happen, this is the season when we celebrate the resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We remember the fact that Jesus died. He didn't stay dead, but He rose again. He rose on our behalf and He gave us victory. So I want you to join me two declarations today. Today being Easter Sunday. First says, Father, I thank you that Jesus rose from the dead. Because of that, I too will arise. Just go ahead. Father, I thank you that Jesus rose from the dead. Because of that, I too will arise. Second declaration, you say, Father, I am under your canopy. I enjoy your security. Therefore, I will give you thanks and I will praise your holy name. I'll take that again. I am under your canopy. I enjoy your security. Therefore, I will give you thanks and praise your holy name. Till I come your way again, I just want to urge you to have a restful blissful, peace-filled Easter Sunday. God bless you. Bye.